start with questions for me if they got my experience. I guess just first of all, what does a win like this mean knowing you know, Wake is coming in 10th ranked? You guys are the underdogs at home. What does a win like this mean for you guys? Uh, this win is big for us, the program, uh, for teammates, for the city. Uh, I just want to thank the fans for coming out and being loud today. Uh, we really appreciate that. We're going to need them the rest of these home games too. And um, I mean, we won that game early in the week. We won't just won today. We won it on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and on Friday. And um, we just came out and executed with both sides of the, what coaches um, wanted us to do. And we did that. Just hats out to the defense. And um, for holding uh, Sam running to whatever he did, he had about five, six turnovers. That's just credit to the defense. So, shouts out to those boys. Malik, in the third quarter, is you guys score, and then you come to the sideline. It obviously didn't take long. We got the ball back. Mm -hmm. I mean, what, what's your reaction <clears throat> is one turnover after another? Keep um, it, just, it just goes to show how much work that defense put in. I, we On both sides of the ball, just struggled some this year. And then the defense been picking it up lately. They've been uh, carrying us for sure. And so uh, just thanks to those guys for getting us the ball back on, on our side of the field. Your career here, this is the highest ranked team that you have uh, beaten. Say it again? This is the highest ranked team that you have beaten mm -hmm. in your career. What does that mean you know, for you, for the guys in the locker room, everybody? Uh, it means a lot. Uh, like I said, man, just not about me. It's because I've been being able to do it without my teammates, uh, the line up front, uh, coaches calling plays, uh, wrong, right, or indifferent, whatever he calls, you got to go out there and execute it. And so, uh, man, just hats out to those guys. A big win for me, myself. But this is more for the city and for the team and for those fans, man. When you're on the sidelines watching the defense, uh, they forced five straight turnovers and six in the third quarter. Two were pick sixes. What were you seeing? <clears throat> what were you feeling? Uh, how was it happening? It was definitely like a, fast, a flashback to like 2016 when uh, Florida State came up here and um, we beat. Uh, but before I got here, they beat them just like that. It was kind of one of those feelings. I uh, was just happy I got a was able to be uh, a part of this one today. Feels a lot like that one. Link, you guys were in an interesting situation after the Boston College loss, but then, you know, you came back and beat Pitt. You guys obviously just had this win. <clears throat> what do you feel like changed with this team to where you are able to? Uh, well, I mean, I just feel like we all look at each other. Um, we all looked in the mirror and just just challenge each other because we know we're not that team that came, that showed up in, in the beginning of September and beginning of October. And uh, we just sink to the level of training and then we didn't quit. That's one thing about this team, we don't quit. No matter how much we're down, we were down. We had to play against the refs and Wake Forest, so and we just kept fighting and it kept battling. And then, and then shh, the football guys on our side today. Anybody else? Right, you. Yeah.